above the skies. Below the depths, scorching deserts, melting glaciers, the myriad moods and mysteries of Earth. Delved into, decoded, demystified, we are the ones who dare to think beyond every day. We strive to explore, evaluate and explain the secrets of yesterday. We are the Geological Survey of India. We are India's nodal agency for geoscientific research. Our tasks now include creating and updating a national geoscientific database through geological, geochemical, geomorphological and geophysical mapping, mineral exploration, utilizing state-of-the-art techniques like remote sensing, aerial and marine surveys supported by high-precision laboratories, nurturing fundamental and applied geoscience research, geotechnical, geoenvironmental and natural hazard studies. Geological Survey of India started its journey in 1851 primarily to locate coal deposits. Over the years, we have diversified to address all aspects of earth science. Today, our charter is to make India geoscientific research play a pivotal role in the nation's vision of sustainable economic development. The Indian terrain is an ideal museum of the Earth's geological history. The Pangaea breakup and the northward journey of the Indian plate has culminated in the most spectacular geological features of the planet. Foremost among them are the mighty Himalayas, still growing. The Deccan Traps, one of the most spectacular examples of continental flood basalts. A vast storehouse of fossils and coal reserves. India's illustrious list of geological monuments makes her almost like the whole Earth in a nutshell. The largest quaternary basin of the world, the Indo-Gangetic Plains. The Ganges Brahmaputra Delta System, a UNESCO World Heritage Site. An active volcano at Barren Island, Andaman. Geological evolution of India has left behind fascinating geotourism hotspots. Columnar felsite lava, pillow lava, extraterrestrial impact crater, natural arch, fossil wood parks. These and many more provide immense scope for geoscientists to research and explore. GSI has been a vanguard of the exploration of India's mineral wealth, like iron ore, coal, copper, base metal, gold, manganese, bauxite, platinum elements and diamonds. A large number of celebrated gemstones originated from India. But yes, right from the beginning, GSI never limited itself to just that. Oldham, who studied the Great Assam earthquake of 1897, introduced the concept of P and S waves and established the nature of core of the Earth. The concept of Gondwana system was evolved at a very early stage of GSI, along with the nomenclature of Charnokite and Condolite. The organization now operates through 33 Pan-India units run by around 2,900 highly proficient scientific and technical professionals. Its programs are executed under five functional missions. Mission 1 – Baseline Geosciences Data Generation Mission 2 – Natural Resource Assessment Mission 3 – Geoinformatics Mission 4 – Fundamental and Multidisciplinary Geoscience and Special Studies. Mission 5. Training and Capacity Building. GSI acquires, stores 
analyzes and disseminates geoscience data and information nationally and internationally. Our achievements include establishment of a geoinformatics division for effective geodata management and delivery system and providing complete IT support for all GSA activities. Geological mapping on 1 is to 50,000 scale of about 3.1 million square kilometer of India comprising 98.4% of the land area of the country. Ongoing geochemical and geophysical mapping of the country. Marine survey and mapping of almost 98% of India's exclusive economic sea zone spanning 2.015 million square kilometers. Vigorous mineral exploration missions have led to significant mineral deposits both in the energy and non-energy sector. Our specialized research projects of high scientific and societal importance are landslide hazard studies, arid environment studies as in the Thar Desert, glaciological studies, marine and coastal geodynamics, crustal movement studies, polar research. With its well-equipped training institutes, GSI imparts training to both domestic and international geoscientists. Our network of training institutes and field training centers cover a vast variety of geological terrain. The knowledge we generate gets shared with the geoscience community through a wide range of publications and the interactive GSI portal. Over the years, GSI has been able to develop a very sound geoscientific database of uh, the Indian land and offshore areas in the country. We have also included a lot of studies regarding the polar regions in uh, recent times. It is our priority now to undertake some high-end technological prognostication of the deep-seated minerals which are also found in our country. This would also be combined with our concern about the sustainable development which is also uh, being kept very high on the priority uh, of our geological investigations. India, a land of age-old, people-centric academic excellence and knowledge sharing, is also a nation with a commitment to uplift the quality of life and preserve it for posterity. And we know that we have the resilience, commitment and expertise to deliver that dream.